Kane's the victim here. It's false accusation. And the only reason he's down the station is because someone's telling the police lies. Right, so it's just one of them things, then. Debbie's dad and a fella don't get on, and then all of a sudden he disappears on his wedding day. So that's what he told the police, is it? Wasn't me that grassed him up. It's Kyle that I'm bothered about. Look, I've kept me neb out. I've let you get on with bringing him up, and it's because I thought that he was happy here. I thought that he was safe. And he is. Well, what if Kane's thrown his weight around? What if Kyle had got in the way? He would never hurt his sons. Right, well, you can take that risk with your own child, Moira, but not with my Kyle. I'm sorry that it's come to this, but it's the only way to keep Kyle safe. So here's what's going to happen now. You're going to phone the school and tell them that his granny's coming for him. No way. Or I'll call social services. Tell them that I'm scared of what Cain will do to him. That his stepsister died of an overdose. That his murdering stepbrother's on the run and that his dad's a killer. You wouldn't do. See how long you can hang on to Isaac before they try and take him into care. <laughs> You wouldn't do that to us. Kerry, you know what it was like when your Amy was taken away? Yeah, it broke me. I deserved to lose her. Just like Cain deserves to lose Kyle. I thought my family was dysfunctional, but you lot, you're off the scale, and I, I don't want Kyle growing up like this. Yeah, don't rise to it, love. I'm gonna go now and pick him up. So you can make that call. Or I'll make mine. It's up to you. I shouldn't have let her take him. I should have put up more of a fight. No, love, you didn't have a choice. The last thing you want is social services on the case. Do you reckon she could actually get him taken away? Yeah, of course she can. She puts her mind to it. I mean, she knows how it works when she lost Amy. Oh, can they let you go? Yeah. No body, no proof, just a statement from whoever it was. Debbie, it must have been. Right. How could she? Despite everything, you're still her dad. Isaac OK? Yeah, yeah, fine. He's just upstairs sleeping. Right, well, I'll tell you what. Let's go and wake him. And then we'll go and pick up Carl from school. I'm going to take you all out. I might have got dragged out of that pub by the police, but tonight I'm going to go in there with my head held high. Chaz is going to want to know the score. Um, Kyle, he, he's with Kerry. Right, so let's go and get him. Yeah, but... There's something I need to tell you, but don't worry, we'll sort it, but it's going to take some time. She wouldn't take no for an answer. She kept threatening us with social services. She's worried about him, I get it. That's the only reason I let him go. You know, I, I just don't want Isaac to be dragged into this. Things are bad enough. Look, it is not your fault. You weren't to know I was coming back. She can't keep hold of him, sex the legal guardian. So, Carl's with Kerry now. About time. He's better off all the way from you, isn't he? Happy days, eh? Well, it is for her. I bet you're ecstatic now that you've torn this family apart. What was it, revenge? Telling the police everything? I didn't tell them. Oh, come on. At least have some guts and be honest. We all know it was you. Just leave it, eh? Whatever she did, she had her reasons. I'm not a grass. No matter what you've done. I might hate you, but I didn't tell them. Debbie? What? I'm telling you, I didn't tell the police. What's... So who did then? Someone else that knows everything. Someone that hates you more than enough. I trusted you. Somebody's been murdered and no one calls the police. What planet are you on? Kyle has gone because of you. I could have lost him today. Isaac could have lost his father. I did it for you, to try and keep you safe, Mom. I don't need keeping safe. I love my husband and he loves me. I can't even look at you. Get out. Go on, get out. 